Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This video I'll be showing you guys how to create this glam look here. I would call this like a classic Christmas glam look but I will be using solely Korean beauty products in this video so if you guys want to see how I achieve this whole shebang here then just keep on watching we are going to prime first and I'm using this Hamish Atlas glow base which is really moisturizing but also lightweight at the same time I'm gonna apply this over my cheek area and my nose before I start using my cushion, I'm going to conceal some of my redness. So just around the cheek area, under the nose, on the nose. The concealer I'm using is by Lily by Rate and this is their Magnet Fit Liquid Concealer which is really light but also gives a really good coverage and really creamy too. I'm just Adding this in. The cushion I'll be using today is the Laneige Neo Matte Cushion and if you guys haven't checked out the full review, I'll put it up here for you guys to check out but this is a pretty um, high coverage cushion and it's like a semi matte and it lasts for a really long time as well so definitely check out my review on that because the longevity for that is amazing and the result after 8 hours still looks really really good I'm done with the cushion, I'm going to do my brows now and I'm using my favourite brow pencil and this is the Hedda Brow Designer Auto Pencil in the shade number 33 the reason why I like this one is because not only like it gives you enough pigmentation but it glides on really easily like if you're a beginner this would be a great pencil to use see just like that really quick I'm going to do my eyes now and we're going to prime first and I'm using the VDL primer applying this all over my lid space eyeshadow palette I'll be using is by Etude House and this is the Gemstone Lay Color Eyes palette which looks really cool and this one has four glitters and five matte I'm probably will use this light brown shade first with a fluffy brush and apply this on my crease area I'm in need of coffee what is pretty pigmented Taking the deepest colour in this palette here with like this pointy brush and then I'm going to apply this on the outer part and the inner part of my eye Apply this on the inner part of my eye so I'm pretty much doing like a halo effect here because it just makes my eyes look more glam every time I do this type of eyeshadow look I just apply a little bit here making sure I don't apply anything in the middle part of my eye so as you can see I left a little bit of a gap here and that's what I want I think I'm gonna try and use the middle one here but I'm actually going to spray this brush with X Plus by MAC so I'm just gonna give this a little bit of spray on the brush and then going to this shadow here and see whether it becomes reflective let's see Okay, now fail. I use this pink one here and I'm just applying this in the middle part of the eye. I feel like there's not enough shine. You know what? I'm gonna just use my pinky because I want this to be really shiny and I think, yep, using the finger is so much better. Way more reflective compared to a brush. I thought if I use like a fix pass it might be better but nah I'm just blending it out properly so it blends in with the other shadow Before I start using eyeliner I'm gonna use this sparkly shade here with my pinky again and just apply this on the inner part of my eye just to you know make my eyes more sparkle I'm just gonna dab this Oh this is pretty, it's like a nice pink iridescent color 
just apply like that. I'm back and I've applied eyeliner and also put a little bit of black eyeshadow on top of the eyeliner. I've also tight lined and I will put the eyeliner that I used to tight line but it's from Nature Republic and it's in the color black. What I'm going to do is I'm going to apply mascara on my lower lash line. I have to show this to you guys because I really really enjoy this mascara. The thing with this one is that this is actually not a Korean brand but I'm so obsessed with this. This is actually a Japanese brand. Not sure if I can actually find this online but if I do, I'll put it down in the description box below because this one really defines your eyelashes and actually extends it really nicely. It doesn't come up as well which is great and the brand I think is called My Lash but yeah, I bought this when I was in Japan. Look at that guys, like look how much it actually lengthened my lower lashes. Like, I love it so much. This is the final look for the eyes. We're finally getting there on the face and the reason why I say it's finally is because this has taken me an over an hour to film this because I have guests coming over and I'm running late for my own party but it's okay. I have to put my makeup on. The bronze I'm going to use is Pede Pede V shading and I love this one because it has three different shades but I like to just mix it around like this and it just gives me like the perfect bronzing color for my face. I apply this on my cheekbone and down here and down here I'm using this Innisfree Vintage Filter Edition blusher which I've done like a full collection video of as well so if you guys want to check it out I'll put it up here but I think I'll go for like probably the probably the middle shade here which is like a mauve pink shade I'm just gonna apply a little bit on my cheekbone just to give me that little of that blush look also been obsessed with the Innisfree Vintage Highlighter as well which is like it comes in three and I think I want to use probably the mm, the middle one here just because I like the champagne gold shade and I like to just use my finger actually and I'm just gonna dab it on my cheekbone area I'm not actually going to put a lot because I want the focus to be on the eyes and the lips but this one will just give me a little bit of like a reflection every time I you know tilt my face and that's my dog again guys I'm so sorry but yeah I'm going to dab the leftover on my nose area um, won't put too much last but not least is the lipstick and I'm going to use the Too Cool For School um, I can't remember what the name, I think Art Valor lipstick in the shade number 4 Muse Rose. I've actually uploaded like a Korean lipstick haul recently which I'll put it up here as well and I did mention that I really want to use this color for a Christmas glam look which I am obviously now. So I'm going to apply this on my lips. To finish off this look, I'm actually going to set it even though I know the cushion is long lasting but I just want to set everything and I'm using this head up makeup fixer. I'm actually halfway through this bottle now so I think I want to actually invest in a food bottle just because I really like this a lot and I think with this one, this is so great for travel friendly as well with the size but yeah maybe I'll get like a full size and a small bottle as well but yeah I'm gonna spray this. So this is the final look of my Christmas glam look. I hope you guys enjoy it. It's really simple to follow. Hopefully it was easy to follow. Um, yeah, I mean, there was a lot of pausing in between, but hopefully you guys don't really notice it. Ignore the noises again. But yeah, I hope you guys have a wonderful Christmas and a happy new year as well if I don't see you guys before that. But yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye guys.